So in this video, I really want to address a popular question, which is, do I need a digital marketing degree or do I need a degree to work in digital marketing? No, you don't. The answer is short. You do not need to have a degree as such. What you will need is a solid base and understanding of the essential skills that you need in business today to be a proficient digital marketer. Now, what's that mean to you? If you have got time served, so for instance, uh, you might have uh, a marketing degree and you've been working in uh, marketing and you want to take the shift into digital, you will need to develop your skills. Again, the same is if you want to get into the world of digital marketing, you will need to gain some form of experience. Quite often when we think about developing digital marketing skills, and this could be many people have got marketing experience, but not necessarily in digital. Some people are looking to do a career change. It is a minefield in terms of understanding what route to go and how to upskill and know that you are not only just getting the right strategies, but you're being taught strategies that are accredited. So the first thing I would say is uh, you need to develop your skills. You need to have a base understanding of all the essential skills in marketing today. Those skills will be search engine optimization, social media, email marketing, content marketing, how to use social media for social selling and how to build relationships, partnerships, affiliate schemes. You'll need an understanding of online advertising that encompasses everything from search engine marketing, so advertising in Google and AdWords and social media. You'll need an understanding also of the key strategies that are working in business today and how to do a plan and an audit and actually create an integrated strategy with objectives and measure your online marketing campaigns and be able to draw tangible actions from the metrics. Now, all of that would mean that you are an encompassed and very skilled and proficient digital marketer. So when we look at do you need a degree, you've got to think about where your skill level is. Now, what can a degree give you? Well, a digital marketing degree, such as the CIM Diploma in Professional Digital Marketing, has been designed by industry for industry professionals and for people who want to work in the world of marketing, but with an understanding of real world business. Because it is all very well understanding these channels and what they do, but you need to be able to operate as a practitioner or at least a strategic marketer. And what I mean by practitioner is, is that you need to understand what all these channels do and how they work. So if you understand how search engine optimization works, then that's great because then you'll be able to operate a strategic level whereby you can lead teams and you can brief agencies of exactly what they need to do how they're going to do that and you have an understanding of what the returns should be for that particular channel and again what the processes that they'll be doing are. So having a firm understanding of each channel and the actions within them, understanding the priorities and the order that these actions have to be taken. So really um, in today's business world if you have worked in marketing then it doesn't necessarily mean you have digital marketing experience again if you've done a degree in marketing it doesn't necessarily mean that you've got digital marketing experience so my advice would be that you would definitely need to develop your digital marketing skills now you could choose to do a digital marketing course and i would definitely recommend doing a chartered institute of marketing accredited course because if you are looking to uh, put this on your CV, really stand out from the crowd, or just get ahead in business today, you need to make sure that you are learning the best strategies, the most up-to-date strategies, and that they are indeed solid strategies that are accredited for business professionals. So the suggestion would be that you don't need to go to university. You can upskill quickly. And the great news is, is if you are a busy professional, like we all are, then um, we have been teaching, or uh, our academy, Business Consort, has been teaching the Chartered Institute of Marketing Diploma in Professional Digital Marketing for a couple of years now. We've been doing digital marketing qualifications for many years. This particular qualification is new, and um, what I love about it is it's constructed around the actual activities that you carry out as a digital marketer. So if you are looking to work in digital marketing, get a pay rise promotion, then I would urge you to really develop your skills, but then knowing that you have something like a qualification, you'll never lose those uh, honorifics. So 
maybe not getting a digital marketing degree in the conventional way, but fast tracking it through without all the university debts means that you can get an undergraduate, uh, undergraduate degree, level six, in as little as 12 to 24 weeks that covers every discipline and channel in the world of digital marketing and will get you to a level where your entry point in terms of salary and positioning and status is a lot higher. So it's whether you want to work your way up or whether you want to go in at a higher level or you want a greater, quicker, faster career progression. So if it was me and I was advising somebody, I would say, no, you don't need a digital marketing degree as such. But if you really want to kind of get yourself out there and you want to stand out from the crowd, then ultimately a CIM diploma in professional digital marketing is going to do just that. Now I've got a couple of questions that I get asked a lot in terms of um, becoming a digital marketer and do you need a degree? Um, digital marketing degree jobs, well the great news is if you do get a degree you're going to go in at a higher level so the starting salary can be 50 to 100,000 pounds opposed to 20,000 that's a big difference. You need to look at the national averages across your country so for instance in the UK if you were to go and work as a digital marketing manager the average is around about 50,000 pounds. Um, if you don't have a skill then obviously you're not going to or you don't have uh, a qualification or experience you're going to have to go in at a lower level so you can absolutely work your way up. Um, do you need um, a degree to be a digital marketer? No, you don't. You can be a digital marketer, unlike a doctor, without having a degree, but you must have experience, as I say, as a practitioner and also as um, a strategic marketer. Um, the sorts of jobs you can get, you can work in a, as a digital marketer or you can specialize in something like SEO or social media. Um, the great thing is, is once you've got a qualification, you do have that choice because you will know the inside working of each channel. Um, what can you do with a digital marketing degree and what jobs can you get? Well, I think the thing is, is you've got to think about what it is you want to do. Not everybody is academic, not everybody is creative. The great thing with digital marketing is it brings the two together. So whatever your strongest point is, it could be that you are a copywriter or a content creator, or a graphic designer. It could be that if you're more analytically focused, that you're more into the planning and the analytics and the metric side of things. So think about the core skills that you need to learn and think about, do you have those skills? If you don't, the differences are what would stand out more if you're looking for a job or you're looking to get into a career well definitely a qualification over a course definitely an accredited qualification like the chartered institute of marketing diploma that i spoke about um, if you want to find out more i've put some links um, into courses and um, so you can go and read about digital marketing courses that are accredited and you can also go and weigh that up against a qualification that's accredited and see which route is right for you because if you've got quite a lot of experience already and you're just looking to close the gap on maybe one small area, maybe the course is the route for you. If you're looking to get into industry or get a career change or you're looking to get a pay rise or promotion, then the qualification may be the right route for you. So come and find out more um, and join the conversation below. Ask me any questions. Um, I'm here to help in terms of your journey. So I hope you've enjoyed the video and I hope it was useful. And I hope it's um, giving you some insight into whether you do need a degree in the world of digital marketing.